Yes, it's me, Pussy. And I'm here tonight. Oh, I love you in my face. <laughs> it's lovely to be with little Terry. He's scuttled away, isn't he? Gorgeous. I think I feel. Look at this. Hello, Parsons. Oh, I feel a song coming up. Yeah. A cheering crowd at my stage door. An audience crying out for more. That's what my public means to me. The loyal fans who queue for hours, the cards, the emails, and the flowers. That's what my public means to me. is looking up, grotesque with gratitude. <laughs> from tiny tots to grannies, I love all your nooks and crannies. That's what my public means to me. The Queen's birthday honors list, this lovely party on my list. That's what my public means to me.
beautiful dress that my son created. And it's a beautiful turquoise, isn't it, Terry? Oh, and it's, it's, oh sorry, you're it's dribbling. People of <laughs> Yes. No, that's good. Just don't don't put it anywhere near an electrical outlet. It'll all go up in smoke. Can you I say I believe you? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh. oh dear. I didn't get any sleep last night because I'm staying at a bed and breakfast very near here. Oh. It's in the mall. It's in the mall. Oh. It's a big building. I, for security reasons, I can't tell you the name. No, of course. But I stay there. She lets me stay there when I'm in London. And last night, Terry, I was trying to get some sleep. I was woken up by two intruders. Yes. And what could be more topical than what I'm doing? Oh, for goodness sake, you're ahead of me. I thought the corgis would have woken me, but they didn't. Oh. They didn't because they're in Windsor with the landlady, so I, I didn't know what these men wanted of me, Terry. And did you oblige? I did. Oh. I did no. and they had books and things. They wanted to As start. usual, and no pen, nothing to write with. Always the same. And I did what I could. The police arrived and they were whisked away. But I, you and I, Terry, and by the way, you come into my beautiful show, don't forget, I'm at the Palladium in London later in this year. As if we'd miss it. And I want everyone here oh. to come. They all be there. Yeah, special concessions for you all. No. <laughs> anyway, Terry, I I know this man. We Excellent. Where else would you get that but on the BBC? Stars, I think so. No, no, some of that is mine. I... <laughs> Parsons, please, just a little bit. Let me see. I... I've known Terry Wogan since the very old days. Terry at the BBC. Oh. It was a party non stop. <laughs> and yet, I always felt safe with you. I, I always felt safe with him. And I think you feel safe with him, don't you? So tell us. No, no, I'm not going any further along that path. No, thank goodness, because I it could lead to talk. And look at you. Look at you. I mean, when you, you were not double-breasted, I remember when he first went double-breasted. <laughs> no, I've, I've moved so, on. A woman. This is good television. Thank goodness this show is not live. Terry. <laughs> a woman came up to me before I came onto that stage. And this woman, she said a horrible thing, Terry. She, she said to me, she don't tense up, Terry, it's all right. She said to me, don't mention his hair, she said. He's very sensitive about his hair. I adore it, Terry. Thank you. And I can return the compliment. I know. Lovely. But you know, I like the little white bits here. I know, because it makes you look a Human. little bit like a badger. It yes. does. Yes, I do. So, don't forage in the forest, Terry. Don't forage. He could be cold, couldn't he, Parsons? Now, listen, I've sung a little song. 
I got the name of, uh, I had a lovely bit in the song that I just put in, I'd rather do it on a towel with Stephen Fry and Simon Cowell. But I always messed up because I was a little bit nervous. Oh, for goodness sake, your you perfection really itself. You are wonderful. You, Dame Edna, are a non pariah Oh, thank goodness. Yes, Dame Edna has graciously agreed to hang around all hang night. Around. Hang oh, around all night. Yes, you will be. To, be de to lead you in the singing. Sing. Of the great last night of the Plums finale lineup. Hi, darlings. My dear girl. <laughs> Dame Edna. <laughs> I wish we could have persuaded her to, to do something. I love you! <laughs> and we seamlessly slide from one splendid promise in the park landmark to another. Yes, we old pals, we old beauties. Here, live on the stage at Hyde Park, we're about to bring you another first. No, a yes, indeed. A fantastic display of professional ballroom dancing. You heard me correctly. Ballroom dancing. Always a favourite on the radio. <laughs> Up there with the juggling and the tightrope walking and Archie Andrews. But this couple, not just a pair of old wallopers. They're international champions. They're stars of Strictly Come Dancing and the nation's favourite professional dancing duo. They're to perform the Viennese waltz to the tune of Wunderbar. Welcome, Anton Dubeck and Aaron Bowe.